Hi folks, my name is Stephen Foster and today I am standing on top of the second highest ridge on Main Island in the southern Gulf Islands, British Columbia. Today we're looking at a 1500 custom built home on this spectacular ridge, sitting on over 10 acres of property. This place is magnificent here on the ridge, overlooking Saturna Island, Salt Spring Island, Sydney, the mountains of the Olympic Peninsula over there in the state of Washington. This is true southwest facing property folks and it doesn't get much better than this. If you like the sun, if you like the ridge with eagle soar, you are going to love this property. Why don't we start with the parked out 10 acres here where every twig, every branch that may have fallen throughout the winter or the summer always gets picked up, ground up and put back into all the, all the little nooks and crannies so that you get an absolutely park-like experience here on this ridge. Uh, if you've ever spent any time in the woods and you have done some cleaning in the forest, you will know that this is no small feat. This takes a lot of work, a lot of love and care, and it's evident everywhere on this property. underground power to the house. We have underground power to the small studio up by the big view spot. We also have underground power to the to the shop or the shed down here where you can actually build an extra shop. There's landscape lighting throughout as well as this great generous parking area for at least four or five, six cars if you will. And then of course there's parking down below. It's a big property. There's lots here. There's lots of space, generous space for you, your friends, your family. And, uh, or none of those people, just for yourself. You'll also notice all the rocks that you're seeing here along the driveway and the pathways. Those didn't just magically appear. Those have been painstakingly brought out of the earth, placed in a fashion all around the farm. That's a lot of stone, a lot of time, a lot of effort that, well, frankly, you don't have to do because it's been done. These little homes are beautifully engineered with the tongue and groove wood ceilings as well as the walls and of course these huge glue lamb beams that protect you from all of the elements. bedroom plenty of space with the ensuite on and a big walk-in shower as well as this great windows to the outsides the flooring surfaces include a three-quarter inch hardwood birch as well as Berber carpeting and then tile in the bathroom and the kitchen for your pleasure
a great loft space upstairs where you can make it a really cool lounge, sit and watch videos. And when you're tired of that, just lean over and look outside where you've got the spectacular, spectacular views. All right, out on the deck, the side of the house here. As you can see, it's pretty spectacular. We're overlooking a beautiful Japanese-inspired garden with pathways. The Japanese gardens here are protected by a deer fence so those pesky critters don't get in there and eat all of your hard work. And of course, like all Gulf Islands, we are on a septic system. Septic's in great condition. The folks here are so meticulous about everything. As you can see from the video and the pictures that there is nothing left untaken care of. If that's indeed a word, untaken care of, I don't think it is, but you get what I'm saying. Well, folks, I think that's about it for today. Hope you enjoyed this video. It's been a ton of fun for me. It's a beautiful spot in the world. Please give me a call anytime you want to see it. My name is Stephen Foster, and uh, yeah, you know the saying. We'll see you next time.